It's not so much the busloads of shouting schoolchildren, the thousands caught in a rainstorm that come dripping into a building this time of year to crowd the elevators and the hallways, the soft drink cans and waste paper scattered around, or the chewed chewing gum on the sidewalk warm by the sun. It's Azalea theft that has the Capitol architect and his men worried this time of year. It's big here. Last year's bicentennial crowd stole a record number of azaleas, and it's back again this year, and the Capitol Architect's office says it has no way of estimating the losses. Those responsible have given up calling in reports to the Capitol Police because it's happening all the time. The plants are just the right size, the Capitol Architect's office says. Two can fit into a car trunk with just the smallest amount of mess. And since there are thousands to choose from, and since a number have recently been transplanted, folks are just not content letting them spread their roots in this climate. A plant this size would retail for from six to ten dollars. What can be done about it? Officials are not sure. They are replanting what's lost. And they're counting on a short blooming season for azalea this year because it has been unseasonably warm here. And they know geranium season will be here soon. Next to azalea, the Capitol visitors determined to take home their piece of the rock, steal geraniums. John Chambers in Washington for Channel 10 Newsbeat.